Alright guys, so a few days ago, I got a two to the morgue from a crucible package, so I figured why not make a video about it, show it uh, to everyone, share it. So I got field choke, range find a reinforced barrel, and exhumed. Exhumed is uh, a perk that's decent. I guess it could help like if you just got revived with a shotgun battle, uh, but for the most part, it's not that great. But I wanted to show everyone a two to the morgue because a lot of the times, if you look up a video on YouTube, you're going to see like the worst possible roll. And this one has a decent roll, so I wanted to show everyone kind of its capabilities, how far it can shoot when it has uh, really good perks and stuff. So field choke adds range, reinforce adds a lot of range, and then range finder. So that's a pretty good build in my opinion. It's not anything like a matador. It's not going to absolutely snipe people consistently. Sometimes it can, but for the most part, it's going to be kind of like a judgment. And uh, it's good, it's not terrible, but it is a weapon where if you get it from a Crucible package, it's going to be a lot better than something like a, the next big thing from the normal Crucible vendor. So I figured if uh, people want a gun for it, this is the perks you'd ideally have, and this is what it would look like if you did have those perks. So uh, it just kind of compiled some gameplay. It's not really that good, not that much primary usage going on, because I mainly wanted to film this. Uh, if for the purpose of this video which is showing the shotgun I didn't want to just go into rumble with a friend and have them sit still and we aim center mass and see how far I could kill them from because a that's inaccurate because it's a non-moving target uh, so there's no latency from lag or anything like that um, you're gonna place like all your shotgun pellets on them because they're not moving at all and you get to aim perfectly at center mass so it's not really an accurate representation of how good the gun is uh, if you saw my fusion rifle video on Twitter, you'd probably know the same thing. I killed someone with a fusion rifle literally from like uh, 100 feet away. and It was ridiculous. So I didn't want to do that. Uh, so I compiled some gameplay. It feels pretty solid. Like I said, nothing compared to like if you have a matador with knee pads, rangefinder, and reinforced or rifled. It's not going to be as good as that, unfortunately. But uh, if you are a 2.0 player or you deleted your matador, then this is a pretty good alternative if you don't have a good party crash or anything. So for Trials, Iron Banner, it's still a really good shotgun. And yeah, I wanted to show it with everyone. It's pretty good. Um, I had a lot better of experience playing on a Warlock with it because it doesn't one-shot that easily. And I don't have knee pads on it, so I can't slide as far as I usually would to get as close as possible to someone. So uh, it's kind of unfortunate, but I feel like Warlock would be the best option for it because it doesn't always kill them in one shot. Uh, but it still feels really good and feels really solid. So if you have a Warlock, you might want to try it out on that first. But uh, still an overall really solid shotgun. I recommend it to anyone that maybe has one sitting in their vault or that they haven't really tried using it. It's pretty fun to use and uh, it's a change if you only use like one type of shotgun. It's, it's a fun little alternative, I guess. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I, uh, I have some more videos planned. I've been grinding for a longbow, yet I have not uh, gotten a single one, not even a battle roll. I have not gotten a single one to drop. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.